Hello, everybody. My name is Leila Garcia, and uh, during this bio hackathon, I will be working with the Bioschemas Validator. You have heard uh, mentioning bioschemas a couple of times uh, during today, so I'm going to briefly explain what bioschemas is about. So, bioschemas is a community project, um, and it aims to improve uh, data discoverability and also basic interoperability for data in life sciences. It is built on top of schema.org. And schema.org is providing uh, types and properties uh, so you can add markup to your web pages. And the idea behind schema.org is that by adding this structural markup, it will be easier for search engines to actually understand what your web page is about. And then they will also be able to aggregate this data in the form of summaries. For instance, the summary movie that you uh, look at Google if you look for a, for a movie or something. Um, then Bioschemas is adding new types and properties to schema.org and those types and properties are related to life sciences. So that is the contribution to schema.org. But there is also a contribution to the community and this contribution is in the form of guidelines and examples to facilitate the adoption. We call these guidelines and examples profiles. Um, we have been asked, um, in order to be really part of schema.org, of the core of schema.org, to show that there is adoption, that the community is actually using these types and properties that we have defined by schemas. But if we want the community to use our schemas, then we need to make it easier for the community to adopt them. So we are working on supporting tools uh, to extract um, the markup, to actually add the markup, and also to validate the markup. And the validation is the aspect that we are going to work during this biohackathon. So the idea is to have a very simple validator that will look similar to what you have in the Google Structure Data Testing. So you just add a URL or you just add a code snippet and then you get a validation on the other side. We have thought about working with Shakes Validation Shapes. And we will use for the biohackathon the bioschemas uh, biotia profiles. These profiles describe what you could expect from a publication, scientific publication. So it includes elements like journals, authors, affiliations, and so on. It doesn't have to be checks. It could be also be shark or JSON schema. We will see which one um, adjusts better to bioschemas during this biohackathon. The idea then is by now supporting JSON-LD, later we will move to other formats and URLs as well via the crawler that we are working on. And having this simple validation page that will show you how compliant you are with the optional recommended and minimum properties that we define for the different profiles and also the cardinality that also comes with the profiles. Then we will call via JavaScript or web services uh, the checks validation tool or the shack or JSON schema, and we will present the results uh, to the user. A further step that we would want to reach is connecting this validator with the fair evaluator. I'm not sure if we will get to that during the biohackathon. We really don't know how to do that bit. And that's it. Thank you, everybody, to the organizers and to the communities participating in bioschemas and biotech.